I'm here to talk about creating styles. It's a great way to format text very rapidly here. I have like these four sections here. I want to put a change the font and everything in here. Make sure that when you do this you're on window workspace and you're on advanced. You have this information here, okay? Uh, so the first thing I want to do, I'm on the text tool. I want to format the text here. I'll do the first one this way and then I, I can create a style based on what I've done. So let's say I want to make this Arial. I could literally type in Arial. Goes in there. Let's say I want to make it bold. And let's say I want to make it a little larger, 14 point. And let's say I want to change the color. I click on this thing here, the T. Gives me the color here, and I just say OK. So I look in here. I've got this all done. What I'm going to click on now is Character Styles, Expand This. The easy way to do this is to take your mouse, alt click next to the middle in here, not the garbage can. This allows you to create a new style. It's based on what I've done. I, I chose caption here and I could give it a keyboard shortcut if I want to because I want to do it real fast. I could hold down the control key and I'm going to use the number three on the number pad. It's not assigned to anything else. And it's going to say apply style to selection. I say OK. Now I go into here, highlight this. I could click on caption or do a control three. Highlight this here, control three. Control three. Everything is done. Now let's say you want to modify the style. You want a slightly different color. Um, I could highlight this text here and the, you could also do it there's different ways of doing this here. I'm going to go into here. I right click. I'm going to say edit caption. Let's say I want to change things here. See where it says character color here? It shows a color here. And let's say I want to make it green. Uh, I click on OK. And then all of them have been done. However, this one originally did not have the style there. And then I could just click on that. It is green you can do other things with the styles when you're doing this. Uh, you can also import styles. Let's say you have a bunch of styles that you want to work with in here. You could click on this little thing here and you could just say load character styles. You can browse. And now Let's say I want to I find a file here and I'm gonna go into here and see if there's any styles in here. I double click on this one here It's going to show styles there, and what I can do is just like check off the ones that I want and say OK. And now they're all showing in here. So if I go into here, for example, I just highlight title, I click on bold, it makes this bold. I highlight this one here, um, italic. It does it there. You could also do it up there. But I'm trying to show you if you create styles here, you can just bring them in from another document. They do not have to be reinvented.